on the 28 hour SQL Server Masterclass on the Udemy platform from only $15 instead of $89. Learn how to become a future developer or either a future DBA or performance expert on SQL Server with 150 exercises. The link to the promotion is in the video description. Okay? Want to get started on SQL Server? Then join me. You can track split page. You can do this uh, through the extended event. Okay? I will show you how to do it through the extended event that is on SQL Server. So let's look for the event. We are interested in through the CSDM package, CSDM object, and CSDM column. This is not a course on the extended event, but it's just to show you uh, if you want to activate extended events on your SQL. So let's run the select and we will start with the operation log hop. Okay? Log hop indicates the type of login operation that generated uh, an event. So we will hop for this one. And we will we will investigate with the GMV map value. Let's run the query and we will work with the map k eleven. Okay? So we will create an extended event on the eleven. So let's drop the extended event if it exists and create a new event with the event eleven. Okay? And of course start the event session because if we don't it won't do anything. And we are going to launch to launch the second script uh, that I put aside in this session, which will create the split page. So let's run the query. So we create a table, insert values, create unclusterable index and insert some random values and return to the first script and we are going to do the select on the XA session okay and you can see that this fantastic query that there were three page splits on the structured index database okay so as you can see free split page isn't much it's just to show you uh, that you can monitor split page on the server through the extended event okay so let's go to the next demonstration